statistically, the church in America has been dying since the 1970s. The church has closed, and so we're auctioning off all of the contents of the church. An organ right there. I think God would be crying with tears in his eyes. I doubt that there's a single Sunday now where I don't come in and look out and feel disappointed. I mean, we've got all these retrofitted, upfitted, outfitted. We've got it going, man. And look at the result of this. I was the pastor, and I don't know what God is. You know, I always say I'm the least religious person you'll ever meet who goes to church every Sunday. <laughs> I don't think I've ever actually attended a service here other than a funeral. The church is pushing people away instead of attracting people. What's going on? What went wrong? This isn't who Jesus is. I'm angry. I'm not against the church, but when it comes to why am I going or not going there, I am detoxing. Nobody likes a big church, except pastors. We are set in our ways, and we can't change. I can't take a friend of mine who doesn't have a relationship with God. I can't drag them into a church. In a decade, America's gonna have a whole different look as far as what is a church and where is a church and what about all these empty buildings. How do we turn church from a noun, a place, and a destination into a verb, a way of being? It's church for folks that don't like church. They do what a church does, which is take care of their neighbors. Ask it all in the name of your son Jesus and for his sake. Amen. It's their church. That's where they worship. They meet God. And then they learn what to do Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday.